name is uh, Ibrahim Mkude. I'm from Nafas Art Space, where I work as a marketing and operation manager. But also, I've been uh, one of the project coordinator for this uh, project that uh, we have been uh, funded by the Ignite Culture. I would say Nafas is a cultural space, a multidisciplinary place uh, in Tanzania that provides trainings, host uh, exhibitions, and other workshops to help uh, emerging and aspiring artists to thrive in Tanzania. Um, the name of uh, Ignite Culture Project is called Sanapa Moja, which is a Swahili word in English, which means uh, togetherness in arts or the arts together. And it's a consortium project that we are working with the uh, Tanzania Bora Initiative and Girls First Initiative. And our project is more on uh, vitalizing and uh, strengthening of the creative sector in Tanzania by providing uh, capacity building to emerging artists and also uh, showcasing platform for emerging artists, uh, traditional and uh, digital. So part of the project that we're doing is also developing a digital app to help visual artists uh, to be able to sell their work. So those were the two main objectives, like capacity building for artists uh, and uh, finding the platform where they can showcase traditional and uh, digital. Uh, donor funding is uh, very important for the creative sectors in Tanzania because at the moment, uh, creative sector in Tanzania is uh, thriving, vibrant, and it's uh, fast growing where there are a lot of activities and there are a lot of opportunities where, where not so many uh, creatives in Tanzania have the fund to be able to tap in or to be able to implement the ideas. So through this uh, Ignite Culture funding or the donor funding, uh, us as creatives, we're being able to test our ideas to implement them and see the benefits and also not only help the organization to thrive or to grow but also helping the artists in the sector in Tanzania to be able to professionalize their career and also be able to present their work, their work to reach out different audience in Tanzania but uh, worldwide uh, at large. I'm here at ZIF uh, representing Nafas Art Space as a part of the Ignite Culture but as well we are also working with another beneficial with Z4, Zanzibar International Film Festival, where we have been organizing different uh, film screening uh, activities, but also exhibition for visual artists as part. But uh, another element also we have been doing uh, organizing performances. There is a group, uh, Tanzanian Da Music, it's Mchiriku, which has also been performing uh, during the ZIF. And uh, the experience so far at Zanz Ignite is amazing. It's, uh, it's also... Uh, one, one that is eye-opener, I can say, because uh, I've got the chance to meet uh, different people that uh, most of the time we used to meet uh, on, online during the Zoom meetings and discussions. But today, uh, I'm able to get to see them, to learn also from them, and even ask them questions that uh, I was not able to ask uh, during those uh, meetings that we have. So it's a very good opportunity, and I've got the uh, opportunity to learn that uh, other grantees what their projects are doing and how we can see collaboration in the future and uh, I really hope that uh, from this uh, Dan's Ignite networking event we're going to be able to do a lot of projects because there are so many organizations across Africa that we do similar activities and we have the same goal of strengthening and vitalizing the cultural industry in Tanzania I think. Oh, uh, what I'm enjoying the most in Zanzibar is the food. Yeah, there's a lot of food and uh, I've been eating all the time, I'm so, <laughs> so I'm enjoying that the most. Uh, and uh, it's not that uh, we don't get a lot of those kind of uh, foods that we see here in Zanzibar, so it's uh, been very interesting to try new stuff as well. <laughs>